Hello, and welcome back to Fire Emblem Three Hopes. So, it is time for us to head into this month's main mission. Which Let's go. Are you headed to? So, right down here, Gronder Field. The battle at Gronder Field. Marching south into Empire territory, the Alliance forces arrive at Gronder Field. A showdown with Count Berkeley's, the Empire's mightiest general, seems imminent. Let's go. Okay, I suppose we can do a little save here before we get started. And then, here we go. You know, once loading screen finishes. Hmm? Is something wrong, my lord? Have you noticed anything amiss? Hmm. No, it's nothing. Looks like we're coming up on Grander Field. And here I was, bracing for a ruthless attack the moment we crossed the Great Bridge. It seems like Count Burglis wants to settle this the old-fashioned way. No tricks, just one soldier bashing into another. And look at that. He was nice enough to have his troops all lined up and waiting for us. Those are all offensive formations. It's as if each battalion is a giant monster ready to pounce. I thought the army that invaded Leicester was fearsome. But this force, they are truly in a league of their own. Your legs are shaking, Moritz. Are you scared? But don't be preposterous. I am merely quivering with excitement over the impending battle. Hey, check it out. Looks like we'll be up against Gerald's company again today. Ooh. Yep. And this time I'll slay the Ashen Demon for sure. Well, my business is with their captain. I just wish there was a way I could speak to him. You know Gerald? Of course. I'm his apprentice, but I haven't seen him in years. Not since he left my village. This seems like a conversation we should have had earlier. Uh, don't get me wrong. I'm not about to go easy on him just because he trained me. I want to take him on and show him how much stronger I've gotten. Gerald's really tough. Don't get yourself killed, okay? You don't need to worry about me. I'll get out of there if it turns out I'm no match for him. Then I'll just keep challenging him until I am. Watch out for the mercenaries. But remember, our real target is the Imperial Army's top commander, Count Burglis. If you aren't confident you can handle him, then keep your distance. But not to worry, because I'll be the one to bring him to his knees. I'm counting on that, Holst. Look alive, everyone. The battle's about to start. Okay. Defeat Count Burglis. Now, weirdly, this is another battle where we're starting with three. Which would imply to me, somebody might be joining us. Well, I mean, we can persuade Petra, apparently. Okay, let's see what we got here. Increase the might of ballista attacks. Increase the attack power of allies and allied strongholds. I'm guessing they might attack our strongholds. Persuade Petra as a guarantee. Hire mercenaries. Summons mercenaries to engage the enemy force. Reinforcements will deploy. Okay. Assign archer unit to protect allies as they advance. Again, these are more like things are gonna... Hmm. It definitely implies that we're gonna be constantly attacked, right? Yeah. I'm just thinking of how we want to handle this here. I think healers could be cool. And then one of these. Maybe ballista? So maybe we take Ballista, Petra, Healers. I think that seems pretty good, personally. Mercenaries are also interesting, so maybe hire Mercs. Yeah, let's do that. Wait, did I actually assign those or did I do nothing? I did assign those, that's fine. Wait, do I have more points? I do have more points, let's have both. Okay, cool. Uh, convoy? We're just going to clear out our convoy here. Right. So, in terms of who should come with us, the answer is obvious. It's Shez, it's Leone, to bring down our quarry. and it's Holst. That I clicked Hilda. I saw pink and was like, ah, I got to my target. Holst isn't here. Ah, there you go. Holst isn't here. That that's what that's why um, we we can't select Holst. So I guess we could have Hilda. There we go. Hilda's apparently good on that side, Leonie's good on the other, Shez is probably good on both. Cool. 
So that's our base lineup of people we can control. Coming up, Claude seems fine. Um, Lorenz seems fine. Um, Marianne is a good secondary as well. You're apparently incredible. Are these, um, yes, these are Cavaliers. Okay. I think Lorenz is the only one I'm not quite into yet. We have a better person. No, I think I'm okay, actually. Yeah, so that gives us a mixture of everything. Okay. It's fine. Um, in terms of convoy, I think we're just going to give people battalions that make them good at what they are already good at. That way, it kind of takes away any kind of uh, confusion. As to, oh, this person's good against that, this person's good against that. No, nah, they're just good against uh, what they're good at. Uh, Marianne. Um, yeah, give you those. Claude. Give you Bo. Oh, and Ignatz isn't in the fight, so he's the last one. Okay, cool. 24 minute S rank? Wow, 2,000 defeated? Okay, that's crazy. Uh, one thing we have to do in our convoy up to Claude. Um, most people have already done this. Oh, Apex Sword, actually, for us. Huge. It's a critical hit damage when equipped with a sword. That, that is going to be nuts in terms of damage. But what we need to do is we need to go through people and add in the extra things that we have. There we go. Like any extra things that we can put in, just add them. Boost critical, that's good. Trust. So that makes him better at adjutant stuff. Uh, might as well have Rebellious Spirit, even if we don't think we're going to run into actually a situation where we would use it. Spirited Seas and One Heart, One Mind. Um, and then you're not in the... Um, act, yeah, you're not actually in the fight. Okay. So this gives us this lineup. So we get these three. We're going to persuade Petra. Um, probably going to send... Like, Lorenz and Leone down south with a Claude backup. Yeah, Hilda with Raph and Marianne left, and then we're kind of jumping between them, I guess. We'll handle defense. I don't know. I don't, I'm not sure if I'm quite happy with that lineup, but that's... I think we're okay. We're also fairly certain that Holst... Oh, wait. We're fairly certain that Holst is going to join in later. Might as well... um. Make sure that he's set up. That's the wrong one. Holst. Try that again. Instead of magic, we give him... Like, sword. Um, actually, instead of sword... Sword's good against axes. We think the person might be an axe user, but they might also... He might also be a brawler. As in, uh, yeah. Count Berkeley. So let's give him archers. Yeah, it might also be that Holst doesn't join us. That's the other thing. Ooh, and then on us as well. We got a new thing. What's Mortal Struggle? Temporarily reduces the user's defense to make the stun gauge display with all attacks. Oh. Okay, interesting. Uh, we'll leave that where it is for just now. Uh, is everybody else fine with their things? I suppose we don't really want people... Like, if they have a level 3 combat art, this is kind of their opportunity to use it. Could potentially give you a heal as well. No, I think we're fine. And then everybody here has been out on a mission or has a hero's relic, so should have a reasonably okay weapon. Cool. Save. Let's go. Fight. Our only... Okay. Before we uh, get into oh, the nice. actual them go. speaking and me being up. quiet, let's uh, Please. set Excuse these me. up. I'm not sure I'll be much use, but I'm coming to. Yeah, let's attack. Don't worry, I won't slack So that's off. what we're doing on that side. Now it is my turn. On this side, I will aid you. guard. Let's try this. Guard. Back them up. Attack, and then we're gonna control chess, which we are. I'm gonna walk behind us and get that um, to take out Count thing first. Let's start by capturing the strongholds on the front line. 
Okay, that makes sense. Where did Holst go? It isn't safe to have people charging off by themselves. He said that he wished to preserve his strength at the start so that he might be fully prepared to face Count Burglars. He can handle himself, but try to keep an eye out for him. Okay, I was basically just heading right. back to get Take the uh, the yellow flask there because I thought that'd be useful. Right, keep attacking. There we go. Right. Just keep going. Got him. Nice. Priest's healing us. Um, we can grab some blue while we're here. Gonna send you right down against that one. We'll grab the blue. How are you guys doing? Doing okay? Almost killed your side as well. There's blue. Which is awakening gauge. Yep. Our warrior gauge is full. Hit him. Perfect. Just get behind him. Oh, that didn't work. Nice damage. Got him. Right. How are we looking? You guys killed your target? You did? Yeah. Perfect. Don't Attack. Don't worry. I won't slack off. Uh, let's see here. You guys doing okay? We could head up and get the other one, I suppose. Let's, let's head back. Right. This way. We have a mercenary here. These will be the mercenaries I hired then. Kind of weirdly. Right, and we'll head up to the one that's far up the top. We've almost got our awakening already. Cool. Head through here. How's everybody doing? You're killing that target. That's fine. You're killing that target. That's fine. Okay. Magic user. Yeah. Uh, that's nice. Nice. Alright. You defeated the Cavalier. Okay. Head south. Nice. Keep slicing. Gotcha. And stronghold captain. Hope you're ready. Hit him. Take this. I got you now. I can still fight. Oh, there we go. Okay, so you're killing your target. I kind of want you in here. Time to make a name for myself. There might be an attack in the base, Captain. Um, right. Chez, go clear I've that target. This. Let's go down here and control Liam. I don't see it's the action turn. demon yet. Better keep on our toes. <laughs> yeah, but remember, our main target is Count Burgley's. There's no guarantee you'll face the action demon directly. <laughs> keep attacking. Gotcha. Nice. Got it. Uh, your goal now is to attack Time that to make one. A name for myself. Over here. Hilda. Well, we can Aren't skip things going now. a little too well? There's no way the Imperial Army is this weak. Yeah. Right, we did it. Yeah, something's off. It's like they're holding back. Okay, Monica appeared. In the name of the Emperor, 
I, Monica von Ox, shall obliterate the Alliance army. Okay, that's fine. I knew they were hiding soldiers somewhere, but we should be able to break through at this rate. Good damage. More people at the top. an ally stronghold. We have to deal with them before they attack us from behind. Okay, um, yeah, your job is to get in there. Don't worry, I won't slack off. Yeah, clear up that side. Uh, we will crush everything else. Take a breather. Hi, Petra. The enemy is gaining strength. I can be catching them off guard and stopping them. Well, that's unfortunate. She is the princess of Bridget, a vassal seat of the Empire. Perhaps we can convince her it would be advantageous to join us. I cannot be letting you through. Cool. I just did that. Right. Spin. Yeah, yeah, I get it. I'm attacking. There we go. Right, now we've done that. Now I can head back down here and work out what I want you guys to be doing. No, no, no. Your job is to attack Petra. Time to make a name for myself. Now You're also going to specifically turn. attack rather there than um, I cannot do. Actually, now it is my turn. You're going to defend this. I will aid you. Yeah. How you guys doing? You're doing okay. Right, back up to us. Huge pile of dead uh, mages. So we probably want to head down and behind Monica then. Right. All right. Take it down. Hit him. I you cool. Not a problem. I'm gonna send you down that way. You're fine. I just think I need to control here. Hey, it's my turn. You are mine. Stomp him. Wheel sweep. Nice. Gives us a little bit of a ranged attack to hit in. Right. Here's a good attack. Hit him. Actually perfect attacks. Perfect, and that's recruited Petra. Um, your job is now to defend here, which you should be okay with. Right. You still doing all right? You seem to yeah, be doing fine worry, here. I right. Slack off. Back over to Shez. There's a lot riding on me, Petra, isn't there? Is it really the smartest choice to die here? You are right. I will be choosing to Nice. Let's keep attacking. We can't let this stronghold fall. That's fine. Uh, where's the... There's the base captain. Right. Right. In here. Now we don't have to worry about them coming up behind us. I'll take you all You are a formidable foe. But I will not back down that easily. And you're already dead. You're quite strong. You're ready. Take this. Right. That'll do that. You're still killing your target. Yeah, don't worry. That's fine. I won't slack off. You're defending all right. We're going to get that one. I think we're okay. Yeah. I cannot push myself any further. <laughs> I'll be back. Oh, another one who didn't die? I'm shocked. Ooh, brawler. Perfect call. Well done. But this is Empire territory. 
Do not think you will retain the upper hand forever. I love that his weapons are just like shields so with knives in them. Wants to fight us in an open field. Out of the way. It's what I expected. But it's still quite a sight to see their army up close. There's no way we'll be able to break through their formation head on. If we could just make Count Burglies come to us. Okay. I didn't really catch what your plan was there, um, Claude. Don't worry, I won't slack off. But we'll work on it. All right. So this is still locked off. So, guard her. Got it. Attack here. Time to make a name right. For myself. We're attacking through the center. Right, you're attacking through the center. We will control there and go down the left-hand side. Sure. I've got it. Anyone who can, go take out the Imperial Generals on the southeast side. Okay, yep. That's fine. Southeast. But there appears to be plenty of enemies to the west as well. Yeah. Just go with me on this. We're gonna defeat those generals and then rave about how Holst took them down. We're gonna make sure the entire battlefield knows that Lester's mightiest warrior has arrived. Okay. That sounds fair. Not a problem. You're going to attack there. I got this. <laughs> you still going? You're still going, that's fine. Um Leone. Get through this way. We're gonna send her to the bottom uh, left in case it wasn't obvious. I just want to kill the brawler first. Right, attack. Because we've got a long time on this mission for the S, I feel like it's worth actually clearing it. Oh, hello. Oh, but. That's interesting. He appears as a neutral character. I suppose until we clear out the area, maybe. And we got another mercenary there, which we can leave the area from. Right. Head this way. Just seeing how everybody's doing. Push this base captain all the way through. Generals, and then pretend like you did it. I see. So he plans to use my name to draw out Count Burgley, eh? Oh, so that's what he's doing. Now it makes sense. This is great. <laughs> the, the pile of enemies. That's just for any that were still alive at the end. Right. Ooh, got money. Right, on the brawler. Wheels uh, sweep, just to knock him off his feet. Got him. Perfect. Could have switched in. Uh, I was gonna say could have switched to Claude. Could not switch to Claude. Claude is um, not controllable. Right. Got the brawler. Next brawler. Hit you. Nice. <laughs> no imperial dog is a match for a whole singer's ball gunner. You are more formidable than I expected. Ah, the enemy appears. Then I guess it's time for the blade breaker to put an end to both you and your schemes. And there's our kill. Gotta keep pushing myself. Wonderful. The blade breaker has certainly made an appearance, but it seems the ashen demon is further back among the enemy troops. Then we'll go after Gerald first. The Ashen Demon might come out if he's in danger. Okay, defeat Gerald and Aloise. I really hope that Aloise is on the left and Gerald is in the center. Oh, -ho, it worked! Aha! Uh -huh. So, we can have Hilda fight Gerald while... Shez fights Aloise. Shez currently surrounded by mages. 
Who are you? Just a brawler. Got it. Okay, attack. Time to make a name for myself. Uh, let's clear out a little bit of space here, shall we? I've got my turn. Spin. There's a commotion on the eastern front. Send any free generals over there at once. I won't lose. Got him. You'll have to send your entire army if you want a chance of stopping me. That was pretty good. We still have a base captain alive here? Yeah, okay. Cool. Um... How are we doing down there? Two mercenaries coming in. Claude, I'm going to switch Let's you to attack. This goes. Um, right. You guys doing okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're doing fine. Right, let's I'm go kill Aloise. Huh. You always come through for us. Even more than I expected. Right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Take it down. Yeah. I was expecting to have some kind of, uh, I was gonna say introduction. There we go. There's our Aloise introduction. Hit him. You think I'm struggling here? This squeezes into my top five tough fights. You just got killed. That was so careless. What was I thinking? Now I have no choice but to withdraw. Okay, I was given Aloise time to Not finish what he was I've saying before I switched character. Oh! We got Caspar and... Look at that, the Ashen Demon bottom left. That's actually perfect. If I'd planned it that way, I would have been very happy. But I'm happy either way. Don't switch. It switch. Up, huh? <laughs> My blood surprised me. Hit. Right. Cavalry Slayer and Gerald. What do you mean she's fighting at a disadvantage? Let's try this. I'd better back them up. Oh wow, she is fighting at a disadvantage. You're right. Got it. Whoa. Now I will eight. Let's try this. Let's see how this. Let's do that. Yeah. Hit. Apocalyptic Flame. Oh, keep attacking. Hit him. Here we go. Here's the finisher. Where's the Empire's strongest warrior anyway? Shouldn't he have stopped you? Hit him. Here we go. Here's the finisher. Got him. <laughs> With the loot on top of his head. Level up for Hilda. I still have a long way to go. That's it. Right. Yeah, let's do this. That's your target. Don't worry, I won't slack off. I have to control Leonie here. Not for now. Everyone, yeah. fall back. <laughs> Feel sweet. Let's get. Let's kill this one. There we go. That might at least give us someone else to help us attack. Mercenaries have withdrawn. What will the Ashen Demon do now? I wonder. They both withdrew. Then it's up to me to turn this around. Ooh. He's advancing. Draw the Ashen Demon into the stronghold. Lure him to the stronghold. Okay, um Got it. Whoa. I should Let's try this. Let's see You how go this back goes. to doing that. Uh, take a breather. Oh. Yeah, we'll lure him into the stronghold. Come into the stronghold, Ash and Demon. Well, that was easy. Okay. The gate's closing. Get out while you still can. Wait, really? Our plans is to shut the gates on them? I love it. Very funny. Now, close the gate! I fell for a trap. 
<laughs> I guess Gerald's defeat shook me. Our fight isn't over. We'll settle this yeah. later. We are Die. unable to stop Hope's defense. Please send aid to us. Out of so, the way! Holst has appeared at last. Then I must go forth and face him myself. I've got you now! Cool. Kaspar, this place is now under your command. Is this fine? Don't you dare lose to him. Oh man, I wanted to fight Holst too. <laughs> the enemy is on the move. Yeah. Count Barclays is headed this yeah. way. Okay. Then he took the bait. Now we need to look. Not a problem. Um, Hilda? Yeah. That one? Do that. Don't we'll worry, get back to the story in a second. Not a problem. You? That I've one? Got this. this pile? Time for him hey, into the stronghold. It's my turn. Wait, we're trying to lure him back into this stronghold? Okay, um. Guys, where is he? At Berkeley's. Yeah, yeah, attack me. You wish to do battle with me, Holst? Then I'd be glad to accept your request. You're the one who sought me out. I will take you on right Holst, here, right please. now. Please. Huh? No, Holst. You're supposed to draw him into the stronghold first. I'm trying to, okay? <laughs> I did, however, give Holst Provoke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Right. Hilda? Well yeah. done. Let's Kill the next worry. target. I won't slack. He's here. Right. Now you do we leave? Just shut the gate. <laughs> Hurry and get away from Count Burglies. I'm away. The He's gate's shut. Close the gate. Now. Did that work? I think that worked. You're sending this many troops after me? Don't think I'm the only lion waiting to strike on this battlefield. That takes care of those two. Now all that's left is to rain down a world of hurt on the Imperial Army. If my father's locked down, then I've got to step up. Take that! Okay. Let's figure out what's happening. So you're attacking that brawler, that's fine. Where is Chez? Oh, there he is. Okay, that's fine. Um, ah, so your plan is to use the ballistic to bombard them with air. Works for me. Wow, host, you knew exactly what he was getting at. You must be Claude. We have lost sight of his excellency. Come on, brawler, just die. You know what, screw it. Gotcha. Get out of here. I'm all right. Get him again. Right. Into the stronghold. Wait, who's attacking here? Who are you two? Right, back this way. Brawlers. Hit him. And. Hopefully that did what we needed it to do. Right. Drag the other brawler. Over this way to the first brawler. And hit him. Hopefully I got them both in that. I think I did. So we kill one? We did. Perfect. Um oh no, you two. <laughs> what are you doing? Let's Alright, attack. Let's see how this goes. Guard. Got it. Defend. Well, I should go help. Right. We should do something over here. Not a problem. Um, control. I've got my turn. Another shadow blade, grab this. Right, take it down. <laughs> Spin. The nice thing about Wind Sweep is it keeps them CC'd for a very long time. So you can keep uh, attacking. For the love of 
There we go, another brawler dead. Roll forward, grab that. Right. Hilda. That's your target. How you two doing? You're doing fine? You've ki- Oh. I thought that person was going off to attack a uh, host. He was going somewhere else. Okay. Go. Us versus Caspar. So you're the ones invading this time, huh? I'll knock you clear out of here. Come on, Stormzy. Yeah, again behind them. There we go. Perfect. Knocks him over. Then we follow up with a wind sweep. Keeps him just trapped in here for a little bit. Oh, they got a good hit. And hit him. Cool. I have to pay you back for what happens at Murder. You wish not. Okay, got him. Um not a problem. That's your target. You kill your one over there, Hilda? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Meet up with this. that squad. Don't worry. I won't slack off. Control. Tyler, I'll go in front. <laughs> I can't believe you beat it twice. <laughs> 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 Yeah. Got the brawler. Cool. <laughs> Got it. Go and join with Claude for just now. Go, help. go control. Take a breather. Yeah. That's the last of them. They won't be looking for Count Burglies now. All right, let them fly. They stole our ballisti? Caspar, how could you let this happen? This is bad. I need to find a way out of here. Yeah? Not? Now's our chance. Everyone, take out Count Burglies. That's fine. All Alliance archers are ready and waiting. Um. We'll shadow s uh, step over. Or shadow slide. Probably know their way around the ballisti better than us. Everyone, fall back if you need to. I'll defeat Count Burglies. Oh, host is now playable. Um. Okay. Shadow slide. Here. Well, couldn't hurt. Not a problem. Attack. I've got this. Squad. Yeah. Let's do. Let's try. I'd better back them. Yeah. Let's do. Don't Attack. worry. I won't slack off. Holst. It's a one-on-one -on -one fight. Your luck's run out. It's in your well, minus that first hit. hit them. That wasn't one-on-one. -on -one. Level up for who? Flawed. Nice. More fighting means more strength. With your deadly accuracy. Astra. <laughs> Your first name is Leopold? There we go. Keep him bouncing. There's a level up for Holst. There's always room for improvement. I can't be stopped. Hit him. Clear out. You're finished. I gotta say, pretty good start to the Face fight. Me if you dare. Astra. Keep some held in position. You've not the strength to slay me, coward. Offer up your final prayers before I send you to the afterlife. I can see why they call you the strongest in the empire. But I won't fall here. Alright, keep attacking. There we go. Keep laying into him. I love the stronghold captains, like, yeah, I can help. 
I'm definitely strong enough for this fight. Doesn't seem like I'm out of my depth at all. Face me if you dare. Off of that, we were able to trigger lightning again. Oh my god, look how much damage he did when he actually hit. That's his first hit. Like, proper hit on us. Okay. Keep attacking. Oh no, we got frozen! Immediately was healing, even before we got hit. Lightning. Got him. Oh. Oh. Full on cutscene. The rumors sell you short, young man. Likewise, sir. But I'm glad to see you're tougher than they say. All Alliance forces! Fall back! Retreat! Oh, what? Too bad. We'll finish this later. <laughs> Until then, keep that head on your neck. <laughs> you too. Why are we retreating? <laughs> we were about to win. The Alliance is withdrawing. Do not pursue them. We will pull back as well. Wait, why? Also, um... Chess? My turn. I don't know how much time we've got left. We've got a problem, everyone. Yeah? Retreat as quick as you can. Sir, the Ashen Demon has escaped. There we go. attacking one of our other strongholds. That's what we have. What we're looking for. No, we can't get cut off. Everyone, attack the Ashen Demon with everything you've got. Okay. The Ashen Demon is as fierce an opponent as Count Murglins. Do not let your guard down for even a second. Just decided we needed this. The others don't stand a chance. You're the only one who can destroy the Ashen Demon. Yeah, I know. I don't know, I think Hilda probably has a chance. Right, got that one. Not a problem. Um, Hilda? Yeah. Let's Wait, do this. Who's everyone following? Everyone's following Hilda yeah, right now. Let's do this. Hilda and Squad. Defend here. Where's Holst? Is Hol oh, Holst just like, I'm out. See now ya. Is our chance. All right. Defend. I'm here to assist. Shadow slide. Here. No escape. Oh, hello. How many times have we fought them? Either way, this will be the last. You're right about that. I'm not letting you leave here alive, Action Demon. Okay, attack. Do not fall to the enemy. No escape. The way he keeps tanking the ballista shots, I'm not too happy about. It's uh, worrying. Hit him. Very cool. We I think we killed the mercenaries. Oh, hello, Holst. I'm getting stronger. Charge. My accomplishments won't mean a thing if I'm not still standing when the battle's over. Keep attacking. No escape. Get around the back. I might actually have to work for this one. We finally got that menace on the ropes. We can win this. Oh, I think he's about to use um, some time travel shenanigans to defeat us. There we go. Yeah. 
Keep attacking. Okay. Dodge. We're about to have another A. We're able to do. Hey, what's he doing? Oh, he's running away. Where did he go? Why did he run away? <laughs> Got him. Uh-huh, yeah, I knew it. I knew it. Such vexing arrogance for one so small. Perhaps you truly are one of their descendants. In any event, you labored to destroy my vessel, did you not? That is a deed most foul. When you will pay for it with your life. <laughs> you cannot hope to win so bound in flesh. Pitiful. This isn't a fight you can win. Get out of there! You can run all you like. <gasps> Why do you fight me? <clears throat> Why so this? There's a a lot to unpack. Way, hurry! Oh my! That 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 cutscene. Many many things like. Sothis being fully aware and taking complete control. Um like yeah, there's a lot going on there. Sorry, Claude. I lost again. I'm starting to think that mercenary really is a demon. Even in a fair fight, we end up looking like chumps. Listen, something's come up. We have to pull out now. It kills me to say it, but our victory here will have to wait for another day. Got it. Let's get out of here. So the Amarian army is attacking. Okay. Oh! <laughs> we would have had an S had I not taken so much damage. <laughs> we did take an awful lot of damage in that one. Um, I think that's because we were lower leveled. We took a lot of damage as Leone. We actually did. We also took a huge amount as Holst. But yeah, it wasn't too bad. Raph leveled up. Gotta get stronger. Cool. MVP, I mean I won't let myself stop here. You, you you knew it was happening. And Shadow Blade's fully ranked up. How is this gonna help? Apex Axe is fantastic, especially as Smash has a higher critical chance, I think. Getting stronger. Ooh. Whole bunch of stuff in here. So the rapiers are very good because they are good against armored and cavalry. Um, armor slayer again, good against armored unit. Probably not, would have been more exciting had we not had a rapier here. Uh, we have the steel shield, which is six defense. There's a lot of stuff here that's really good, and anything that isn't good we can uh, get rid of. Wow. Okay. Lots of stuff. Huge amount of money. And a sea level support. And Petra! The fight was so long. I forgot we got Petra at the start of it. And 10 more renown. And a whole bunch of story, which we're about to get, I assume, even more of. Why have you ordered a retreat, my lord? We nearly had them. We've received an urgent missive from Duke Goneril. The Almirans are making their move. <sighs> of all the times. On what scale? From what I gather, it's bigger than the force we faced two years ago. We need to get back to the Alliance, and fast. But the attack two years ago was supposed to be the biggest one we faced in a whole century. The Duke always keeps a careful eye on developments in the East. If that's what he says, then it's true. Even if Duke Goneril and the neighboring lords rally all their remaining troops, it won't amount to much. Do you think we can make it in time? We'll be cutting it close, but that's what Fodlan's locket is for. It should take the Almirans a while to break through that hulking chunk of stone. 
We're not moving fast enough. I'll go on ahead. My lord, I leave it to you to finish things here. Sure thing. We'll be right behind you. Just try and hold out until we get there. Everyone prepare for a full withdrawal. If we don't get home soon, we won't have one to return to. <sighs> With this latest turn of events, it seems unlikely we'll see the Ashen Demon again anytime soon. And here I thought we won. Yeah, but actually it turns out all we did was uh, cause Sothis to take over and we got Ascended Ashen Demon, effectively. So green hair, superpowers, all that sort of stuff. Hmm. As did I. Who knew the Ashen Demon had that kind of strength? Not that I'm making excuses. You gave me power of my own, and it still wasn't close to enough. I'm wondering if either of them are going to bring up the fact that he said Sothis. I don't know whether technically Shez heard that, or whether Arval already knew. I'm kind of interested either way. That's not true. Of course it is. <sighs> what am I even up against here? It's like I looked away for one second, and suddenly I was facing someone else entirely. Hmm, that would explain what was troubling me before. That is the unique danger I sensed. Still, you can win this fight. I know you can. And I'll do whatever I can to make it so. We'll claim victory over that monster together. Hmm. We'll take courage. You know what? You're right. I'll be strong enough one day if I just keep at it. Still, one day could be years from now at this rate. We should probably think of a backup plan. And hey, the Ashen Demon's a mercenary, right? Might be best for the Alliance to toss some coin their way and put this whole rivalry behind us. It wouldn't be a very satisfactory ending to the story though, would it? Ah, yes, we were fighting a lot, but then we decided not to fight and paid them. And that was the end. It does, it, it's not really a very satisfying game at that point. You want to hire that thing? Seriously? Fighting side by side with the Ashen Demon? Are you mad? It would mean that pretty much nobody could win against us. You make it sound like the worst idea in the world. We have a war to win here, remember? Gotta keep an open mind. Ah, I understand now. You've witnessed your adversary's true strength and convinced yourself you cannot win. What? No. I just know a valuable resource when I see one, and we're far better off with them than we are against them. If that's really how you feel, then so be it. But trust me, you don't need to worry. You'll get stronger soon, I promise. So maybe don't go relinquishing your prey just yet. After all, I desire nothing more than to see you achieve your goals. <sighs> A glove does not defy the hand, and yet you've done just that. Oh, hello Sothis. Um, this was unexpected. I was also just wondering, like, currently, I'm wondering what's up with Arval, right? Because the entire story up to this point, like, Arval has been very minorly involved, right? They gave us glowy powers, but it seems like Shez is pretty much fine without the glowy powers, and is actually pretty good. So apart from making us survive the initial encounter, what, like, what does Arval serve? Like, what purpose does she serve in the story? That's a bit I'm missing, right? I mean, obviously we're going to get something between Arval and Sothis at some point. It's just, it, it, it's interesting. Um, I'm feeling like there's some larger plot that we haven't quite got into yet. Sothis is my name, yet I am also called The Beginning. I am progenitor and mother to all who call Fodlin home. Where am I? I am not here to answer all you ask. Yet, I will grant the one. You stand before my throne. If you so wish, then take a seat. But know then that your flesh is mine to wield. You lack the power to resist. My flesh? What are you saying? You should not have interfered! I could have cut that wretch down with a stroke! Oh, that one vexes me so. When next we meet, I must step in and deal with them myself. It is quite clear that you cannot my power safely wield. 
Do I speak plain? Um, sort of? Not in the slightest. I have so many questions. Hey, lazy bones. <laughs> Get up already. You sure you're all right? You don't seem like yourself. I'm, maybe I'm wrong. Is this not like the same kind of conversation we get at the uh, start of Three Houses? Like maybe down to the word between Gerald and um, uh, and Byleth at this point? Seems very similar if it's not exactly the same. I'm fine. Just a strange dream. I think it's exactly the same. Like the ones you used to have. Yes, but this time we talked. Huh? All right, so that's a little bit longer. You fool! That was no dream! <sighs> What's wrong? Do you lack wits? My voice is not for him. Whenever I speak, it is for you alone. On second thought, I think there is something wrong. I mean, my hair's still a different color, right? As are your eyes? Yes, and your eyes too. How that happened is beyond me. Anyway, we lost the battle, so probably best to wave this place goodbye and find somewhere to rest up. Is that a fact? Actually, I think I'd feel more comfortable staying here on the battlefield a while longer. I just need to swing my sword around and get my head on straight. Don't worry, I'll be fine. If you say so, but if it gets any worse, tell me. So, the Alliance army turned tail and ran. Surprising. It looked like they had plenty of fight left in them. They received some sort of urgent message. I imagine that means a crisis has popped up somewhere in the Alliance. Almira, probably. After only two years, the Almirans have certainly grown restless lately. Maybe they're in the middle of a succession. Been 20 years or so since their current king took the throne, after all. So, what are we gonna do? Go after them? No. We'll let them go. But when the Imperial Army tried to withdraw from the Alliance, they were hunted down, destroyed. We should give them a taste of their own medicine. Yeah, but if you stop the Alliance Army from stopping the Almirans, then the Almirans become everybody's problem, at least from what we heard from our history books that we uh, read through. The enemy's retreat takes them through our territory's richest grain fields. If we engage them, the Empire's breadbasket will go up in flames. Actually, that's a fair point as well. What's more, they're leaving those fields untouched when they could just as easily set them ablaze. We'll repay their decency and kind. Well, okay, if that's how you want to play it. Minister Burglies, I must return to the Emperor and brief her on these latest developments. Do what you must, but please deliver a message from me as well. About this war with the Alliance. Oh, okay. Our war with the Alliance has gone on long enough. That's what Minister Burgley said. Um, yeah, I mean, that seems like a fair thing to send. I'm just working out who everybody in the thing is. So obviously we got Hubert, Monica, and Edelgard. Who's the guy on the right? Is he related to Hubert? Or... He kind of looks a little bit like Lintart, which is what was... But maybe, like, older? Yes. Although he didn't say so begrudgingly, it was almost as if he had come to respect the Alliance and its leaders. The Minister of Military Affairs, admiring an enemy of the Empire? I cannot say that pleases me. The Emperor alone has the discretion to decide when to bury the hatchet with a foe. And when to bury it in their back. That foolish war horse has always caused nothing but trouble for me. You and the Emperor should be prepared for more of the same. I'm, I'm just trying to work out if I could remember who Hevering was, as in last name. Don't know. <laughs> then we shall continue to rely upon our Minister of Domestic Affairs to keep him in check. I assure you that man only ever pretends to listen to what I say. But I will grant that if nothing else, his intuition rarely misses the mark. Therefore, Your Majesty, I would urge you to seek an armistice with the Alliance. I must confess, the same thought occurred to me when I heard that Ferdinand had failed to capture Deirdre. 
Perhaps it's time we focus the entirety of our armies on the Kingdom Front and cease our attempts to conquer the Alliance through military means. Hmm. Yes. Through military means. That sounds like he's about to go and poison someone. When an opportunity presents itself, send an envoy to Claude. Assuming he doesn't fall to the Almirans, that is. He made short work of one of our armies. He will not lose to Almira. We should inform Minister Burglies of your decision at once. If he catches wind that the Alliance forces are struggling, he may well charge off to fight Almira himself. I hardly think he would do something so... On second thought, who knows what that man would do. Minister Havering, I shall leave it to you to compose the missive. Please write what you must to ensure the Count doesn't do anything rash. We will save. And then, new chapter. Golden Wildfire. What makes a king? Though victory is within their grasp, news of an unexpected incursion from Almira forces Claude and the Alliance army to retreat. Driven by revenge, Almira invades with a far larger battalion led by none other than Prince Shahid. The Alliance hangs on by a thread, but Claude has another plan up his sleeve. Of course he does. It's what Claude does. Looks like we made it back in time after all. The fighting hasn't really picked up yet. I'm sorry about all this. I dragged you on this forced march right after our first assault on the Empire just to face a new enemy on a new battlefield. I always thought Almira might attack, but I never predicted they'd pull together an army this big. This is exactly why I didn't think we should attack the Empire in the first place. But I'll admit that no one could have seen this coming. Sometimes you just get unlucky. And I don't think there was any avoiding this. Well, at least the Imperial Army didn't come after us. So our troops are still battle-ready. And there's been enough meat in our rations to keep me energized and raring to go! Thanks to the support from Margrave Edmund, we've had plenty of provisions. There is no reason we should not be able to fight effectively. I am thinking, um, with the switch from like the way that the game was focused in Three Houses to the way it's focused in Three Hopes, um, some of the characters didn't quite translate as well across. Like, Raph just seems like an odd person to have here, right? In Three Houses, it made sense. You were, like, in a school initially, so there was a little bit more time to get to know, like, a character who was less focused on the overall conflict. In this one, it's, like, all about battles and wars, and it's just like, and Raphael is here, and he likes to eat meat. I feel like his character would be even more odd if there hadn't been three houses beforehand. Like, if you knew nothing about him, he's just kind of like, he would just be here. He'd, like, he'd just be a random character who has no real place in the story right now. I don't know. Maybe they're gonna tie him into something later, but it seems unlikely. That doesn't change the fact that messing up now could mean the end of the Alliance. All because of my miscalculation. I mean, if you look at every other member of our group, Maybe Ignatz is kind of in the same thing, but like you got, um, like every other one is connected directly to a noble, or it, like you have Hilda, whose brother is in it. You have Lindhart, who's having major story beats. You have uh, Leone, who's got Captain Gerald as her connection to the story. You got like Scythia, who's kind of connected in with this uh, Lindhart's, and that's Lindhart with the Lorenz story. You got the um, like everybody else has some kind of connection into the main thing. Raph, not so much. Come on, we always dump all the tough planning on you. We've got nothing but appreciation for the work you do, Claude. Sometimes you get lucky, sometimes you don't. What matters is that we made it here in time. That's what counts, right? Come on, Claude, let's get moving. Sounds like I'm the one who needs to get his head on straight. Okay, time to put all that behind us and focus on driving back this invasion. Let's go. No movement on the Empire side, huh? All this quiet only makes me more anxious. Perhaps what keeps them at bay is the fear of having to face the famed hero of Daphne. Irvin, do my ears deceive me, or did you just make a joke? I do not jest. 
Your being here is the only thing preventing me from surrendering to the Empire this very instant. You can drop the traitorous villain act. I know you've done more for the Alliance than anyone else. You give me far too much credit. All that has ever mattered to me is ensuring the well-being of the common folk in my territory, not the Alliance itself. And that's what makes you a great lord in my book. Or rather, it made you one, I suppose. Indeed. Now I am but a humble retiree, ready to enjoy my decrepitude. Maybe now, people will actually leave me be. I wouldn't count on that. You'll have plenty of unwanted company if the Empire attacks. Oh, I do not think we need concern ourselves over that. If the Empire had any intention of continuing their war with the Alliance, they would have struck already. I imagine they have reconsidered their plans following that last battle. It was foolish of them to start a war on two fronts in the first place, but it would be even greater folly yet to continue after witnessing the might of the Alliance. Hold on. Are you saying the reason you volunteered to defend the Great Bridge is because you figured it wouldn't be attacked? Mm, now there is a thought. Humble retiree, my foot. You're just as shrewd as ever. You honor me, Lady Judith. <laughs> oh! Oh, okay. Pretty simple map for this one, huh? <laughs> it's us and the quest. Cannot hold any more supplies. An award is available. Everybody wants to speak to us. And I can finally check the menu because what is your last name? Von Hevering. It was he was meant to look like Lintar because it's his father. Perfect. All connects in. Just, you know, a moment of sanity for myself there. Alright, well, if what it's saying is true, then I think next time we run around, talk to everybody, collect our resources, and then have a look at the map. It may be that we do our training and our fights. Uh, yeah, we might do our training and our volunteering next time, and then just chuck ourselves into the main mission a time after that. I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.